Today we're going to go shopping at Costco. I have the three little girls with me today. And we're going to go do some damage. It's Jaya. What's my name? Jaya. And Tamara. And Tamara. With me and Jaya. And Sarah. And Baby's in the back. Aviva. But there's only girls at home. That's right. So we're going to go shopping at Costco today, and then when we get back home, we will show you everything that we bought, and yeah, come shopping with us. Mommy! Oh, Mommy's asleep. I'll have to take the whole chair. Mommy! I'm coming to get you. Can hop out. We need to go to the bathroom. Yeah, we're gonna go to the bathroom. Way too bad. Go to Now that the bathroom break is out of the way, we can get on with our shopping. Every time we come to Costco, my girls have to check out the jewelry case. There's always something there that catches their eye. And they do actually have some pretty nice stuff. Tamara was pointing to some earrings that she really liked. We're making our way down the snack aisle now. I used to buy this really good vanilla flavored pea protein shake powder at um, at Costco and they it used to have a Heckscher, but then I came back the second time and they still had the product, but the Heckscher was no longer on the package. So I'm not too sure what happened there, but I was rather disappointed about it. <laughs> oh, and my raw cashews, look at that, they're on sale. I am definitely gonna grab a bag of these. Um, it's a really great price for this amount, and I use them quite often. Oh, look who's awake. Look who's awake. He's so down at the Yes, he is. I saw these little pajamas for girls, and they were just so cute. These little cherry blossom pattern. I was actually looking for pajamas for Aviva. And these are just going to be perfect for her. What? You stuck? I was also looking for some pants for my husband. He is notoriously difficult to buy clothes for, so I'm not too sure. I might end up returning those, <laughs> but we'll give it a try. Moving on to the refrigerated section, I am grabbing some cheese here. This one is certified OUD. And it's a good price. It's the best one I found in our area for cheese. My kids love cheese. They're just cheese fiends. Whenever it goes on sale, I will buy more than one and freeze the extras. I do regularly buy the Stone Mill Bakehouse multigrain sourdough loaves here. It comes in a three pack, but I didn't actually need any, so I didn't pick any up this time. This is my favorite almond butter. It's a really great price for this amount. And as you can see, it's also OU certified. For honey, this is not a bad price. It's a three kilogram bottle. Um, but what I like about it is that it's unpasteurized. So I'm gonna grab one of those because I'm planning on making garlic honey for the kids in the near future. This is the smoked salmon that I always purchase. It is normally $19.99 for 550 grams, which is already the best price, but today it was on sale. So I am getting two packages. This is the kefir that I buy. It is $4.99 for a two liter bucket. And I usually like to eat this mixed with chia seeds and blueberries. And the kids also love it. So I will give them this instead of yogurt. And I will also use it in place of buttermilk or yogurt or sour cream in recipes that call for those items. I will use this for olive oil. I'll often buy this three liter bottle. It is $17.99. I was very tempted by these Reese's peanut butter chips, um, but I, <laughs> I resisted. 
These pita bite crackers are one of my kids' favorites, um, but I spotted these sweet beet crackers. They were on sale, and I thought they looked cool. We'd never tried them before, so I'll add those to the cart. Aviva was very determined that we should also buy a box of pita bites. Uh, I think we still have some at home, but why not? Good. And we paid for our purchases and now we're on our way back to the car. Got to load everything in the trunk and we will be on our way home. Aviva is at that I do it stage in her life. I'm sure some of you can relate. Okay, go get more. So, so what we have is, um, so we have oil, honey, um, I, these two pants are for Abba. We got nuts, lemon, cheese and yogurt, and some chips and some tuna and yep and we got um we both matched that um aviva and today are matching up to their um pajamas and this is for clean name laundry <sighs> so now that we have our purchases arranged a little more aesthetically on the table uh, let me share with you exactly what we got. Um, so the first thing is the smoked salmon. These are 550 gram packages. And this is our favorite salmon to eat on Shabbat. My husband really loves this brand in particular. And you can see that it's OU certified there. The next thing is this three kilogram bottle of liquid unpasteurized honey. I would use this if I am making challah or honey cake, or like I mentioned in the store, I intend to make garlic honey for the kids. The next thing is this olive oil. It is a three liter bottle and it's 85% refined olive oil and 15% extra virgin olive oil blended together. Now these sweet beetroot crackers, these looked really interesting. They were organic, they are OUD certified. You can see the little symbol there on the corner. And I will show you the ingredients. They are organic stone ground white maize, organic sunflower oil, organic beetroot, organic black sesame seeds, organic flax seeds, organic ground paprika, organic chia seeds, and some onion powder and salt. And <laughs> they are pink to boot. This is the kefir that I showed you in the store. It's a two liter bucket and it is COR certified. I will use this um, as if I'm making pancakes or waffles or any kind of baking that calls for yogurt or buttermilk. Uh, uh. This is the box of pita bites. It is OU certified. You get 567 grams uh, for $6.99. And this is the chive, garlic and chive flavor. Here's the tuna that I bought. It is a eight package. I like these cans of tuna because they are slightly bigger than the ones that are at the normal grocery store. And this is the one kilo bag of raw cashews. I use this for making a lot of vegan or parv recipes. And it is COR certified as you saw there. We did break into it at the store. And this is the fabric softener that I bought, a five pound bag of lemons. And then I found these two little sleepers for the girls. Um, one is a nine month size and the other is a 24 month size. They were only $7.99 a piece, which I thought was really good. They're 100% cotton and the pattern was just adorable. So I got matching ones for my two baby girls. And then I found these two pairs of pants for my husband. I, like I said, he's difficult to purchase clothing for, so I'm not too sure if we'll end up keeping them, but 
Uh, Costco is a pretty good return policy and I'm not worried. These ones did have this really soft, almost like a felt lining and I thought these would be great for the winter. We live in Canada, by the way, and we have brutal winters. <laughs> so I thought these would be handy for him to keep him warmer if he has to work outside or anything. Yeah, so that is it for our haul. You can see here from the receipt that I spent $184. And by the way, the fabric softener is not on this receipt since it is for the Airbnb. Thank you so much for coming to Costco, coming shopping with us to Costco. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. If you love the video, I invite you to subscribe to the channel. If you have any questions or comments, you can also leave a comment in the comments box below. Oh, yeah. You were supposed to keep your hand out of the frame. <laughs> Nobody needs to know you're nursing right now. Oh, yeah. Oh, there's my boy.